that freedom-loving nations. The president of Lithuania is accusing China of favoring Russia in its war with Ukraine. Thank you. In an interview with Euronews, Gitanas Naseda said that despite Beijing's attempts to appear neutral, it's not. He does add, though, that he would welcome it as a peace broker if its efforts were genuine. Unfortunately, I see the attempts of China to continue this war, to make this war even more bloody. And uh, in such a situation where China is in the hidden or open form supporting Russia, it's very difficult and not trustful to believe that uh, China may play the role of mediator between the uh, two countries. If it, will, it would be at least neutral, I could imagine such a status, but, but uh, now I, I, I do not see the possibilities and I think China has to consider uh, what uh, it uh, wants to, to achieve in this war. So far I, I, I uh, uh, evaluate and uh, I see the role of China as rather destructive than constructive one. There are growing rumors of an imminent visit by Chinese President Xi Jinping to Russia to meet with Vladimir Putin to discuss the prospects for peace. In relation to sanctions, the Lithuanian president says that the measures have done some damage to Russia's economy, but he expected more. It's why he now wants EU governments to overcome their national interests in order to approve more restrictive measures in the nuclear sector. Take the 10th package uh, of sanctions. It could be stronger, and our suggestion was to include Rosatom as a company, to include board members. We know what is happening in Zaporizhia, and they are just threatening all of us in Europe with a uh, nuclear catastrophe there. But due to some interests, due to individual approaches of the individual countries, we were not able to take the decision in this regard. Now, Zayda is also in favor of delivering all kinds of weapons to Ukraine, including fighter jets, and to do it as fast as possible, given that the war is costing a great deal in terms of human lives and infrastructure destruction. We are entering the critical stage of this war, and this is very important to stay decisive. Russia is decisive, and Russia is able to concentrate all their resources because this is not a democratic country and they can ignore the needs of society in other fields and social economic field. And they are concentrating the efforts, uh, boosting the defense industry. Uh, but we can do the same and we should, we must do the same. The Lithuanian president adds that he is pessimistic about the possibility of a return to the negotiating table in the foreseeable future, given that Moscow and Kiev have such distant positions.